Hi guys, um, me, I'm back again um, and I actually wanted to do a quick follow-up uh, to the topic that, um, that I did on Tuesday and that's um, being unapologetically yourself. Um, wow, um, this, this kept coming back to me so I, um, so I had to do this. Um, and in particular, I'm talking about the labels that we put upon ourselves and, and how we can own those labels, take them off, and be ourselves without apology, excuses, reasons, justifications, whatever. Um, in particular, I wanted to speak to the types of, um, I wanted to speak about the, the types of labels that we put on ourselves, such as, um, an, I'm an alcoholic or a junkie or a sugar addict or a sex addict. Um, you know, for those of you that uh, are addicted to um, pornography, kitty porn, bestiality, whatever, um, what have you, this, this video is for you. And look, if you're, if you're that person who's, you know, you can say to anyone um, that, hey, this is me, this is what I do and I own it, I have no qualms with this, then so be it. This this video is actually not for you. Um, this is for the person who's listening to this right now. And this is starting to resonate with you that you're actually doing something. Uh, you call yourself an alcoholic. You call yourself a junkie, whatever, and you don't feel good about it. I'm talking to you right now. Um, and and before I go any further. Um, I want you to know that I am not judging you. That is not my job. Um, you are the best judge. You've been doing it for yourself. It's not my place to do that. My job is to love you. My job is to show you a way that is different than anything that you've ever known. Um, so let's do that. Let's, let's be here and now. Let's be ourselves unapologetically. All right. So if, if you are the alcoholic, if that's what you call yourself, if you do the, the drugs or whatever, um, I, I want us to change that. I want you to change that for yourself. Um, and how do we do that? It's like it's like the previous talks that I've that I've given in that, you know, if in that beautiful quote, if you don't like what you see, then let's change the way that you see it. So it's the same thing here. It's the same way that I've changed my body and gotten really OK with myself. So if if you're the person who um, who drinks um, first of all, let's remove that label. Let's remove the, the I am an alcoholic. You are a person, a character who drinks perhaps too much. That's not my place to judge, but that's you, right? Or, or the person who, who does the cocaine or whatever. In fact, let's go there right now. So the next time that you pull out um, a drink and or, or a line of Coke or six or whatever, you turn on, uh, you know, the 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 internet to, to to look at child porn or whatever it is that you do the next time you go to do that instead of the guilt shame the fucking why am i doing this again i vowed that i would never ever do this again you've got that pack of cookies in front of you or that whole stash of sugar whatever it is and you're berating yourself please first stop there okay and and what i want for you to do is to change the way that we see things. So you've got that thing in front of you. And, and instead of the guilt, shame, fear, anger, frustration, whatever, let's turn around and let's celebrate that thing. We've got a glass of Johnny Walker and then the bottle right next to it. Let's celebrate that you're about to drink that. And instead of all the negative, nasty stuff that you tell yourself, how about this? Allow me to suggest something else, which is, I allow myself to drink this. This is the very best thing I can put in my body. Or if it's something that you're watching um, that, that doesn't sit well with you, but you just can't get off. And it might just be YouTube. It might just be Netflix. It doesn't have to be pornography. It's something that you just can't get away from. Sit there and say to yourself, this is the very best thing I can do for myself right now. And... As I've said before, um, the things that you see that you, pr now that we've, we've started to change the programming in your mind that it's not 
bad. You've taken away the label of being an alcoholic or being this or being that. The thing that you do that you previously did that you were frustrated with, embarrassed about, ashamed of, that thing will start to change. It will start to change. You just, we've just got to see it in a different way. So instead of resisting it and then ending up doing it, do it anyways and celebrate it. Be here and now. That's how we get through things. That's how we change our lives. So let's do that. Again, I'm not here to judge you. I'm here to love you. I'm here to show you a different way to yourself. It's not outside of you. This is, this is what I have to do. I am like you. I am you. I am. Whether it's in, in this lifetime or a past lifetime or in the future I become an alcoholic, I don't know. But I, I, know, I know one thing, and that, we, that is that we are all fragments of the same source. And I can be whatever you are, and also you can be whatever I am, and whatever you think that is. God bless you. Thank you for tuning in. Lots of love to you, and see you next Tuesday.